Welcome to Psalms and Blessings. Have you ever felt overwhelmed by life's challenges? Maybe you're searching for safety and comfort in difficult times. Today, we're exploring two powerful prayers from the Bible that have helped countless people find peace. These prayers are Psalm 91 and Psalm 35. Psalm 91 is known as the Soldier's Prayer. It speaks of God's protection and refuge from danger. Then we have Psalm 35, a heartfelt cry for help and deliverance from our enemies. Both of these psalms are rich in meaning and offer deep spiritual comfort. Let's start with Psalm 91. This psalm brings a sense of hope and safety. It begins with the promise of dwelling in the secret place of the Most High. This is a powerful image of closeness to God, where we can find shelter. Imagine a soldier seeking refuge from the storm. That's the essence of this psalm. It further explains how God covers us with his feathers. What a beautiful depiction of protection. Each verse encourages us to trust in God. For example, it tells us that we will not fear the terror of the night, nor the arrow that flies by day. Isn't that comforting? Imagine facing your fears with confidence because you know God is with you. Psalm 91 also speaks about a thousand falling at your side and ten thousand at your right hand but it will not come near you. This is a powerful promise. It assures us that even in times of trouble, we are under God's mighty care. Now let's recite Psalm 91 together. One he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Two, I will say of the Lord, He is refuge in my fortress, my God, in Him will I trust. Three, surely He shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler, and from noisome pestilence. For he shall cover thee with his feathers, and under his wings shalt thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. Beautiful, isn't it? Psalm 91 is a reminder that we are never alone. Now let's shift our focus to Psalm 35. This prayer is often referred to as a cry for divine intervention. It begins with a plea for the Lord to plead our cause against those who come against us. When we feel attacked or belittled, it's natural to seek justice. In Psalm 35, the writer calls on God for help amidst enemies. It emphasizes that God is our defender. The verses show a deep sense of urgency. One plead my cause, O Lord, with them that strive with me. Fight against them that fight against me. What a strong declaration. It paints a vivid picture of a person in distress, seeking God's justice and deliverance. We all face struggles in life. There are moments when we feel powerless. But through Psalm 35, we can find strength. This prayer reminds us to trust in God's ability to deliver us. It continues with rallying cries for rescue and support. 2. Take hold of shield and buckler, and stand up for mine help. In these words, we find immense encouragement to stand firm in our faith. We can find assurance that God sees our struggles and cares about our battles. Let's recite a part of Psalm 35 together. One contend, O Lord, with those who contend with me. Fight against who fight against me. What strength comes from these words? When we pray Psalm 35, we acknowledge that God fights our battles. We don't have to face our challenges alone. These prayers hold a transformative power. Whether you are praying for protection or deliverance, God hears you. It's essential to reflect on the impact that these psalms can have on our lives. So, which psalm speaks to you more? Are you seeking protection, like in Psalm 91, or deliverance, like in Psalm 35? Remember, you can always turn to these prayers when you need comfort. Take a moment now to share your thoughts in the comments below. What experiences have you had when praying these psalms? Your story may inspire others in our community. Thank you for joining us today on this spiritual journey. We hope this exploration of Psalm 91 and Psalm 35 has touched your heart. Remember these prayers are always available to you for comfort and strength. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe to Psalms and Blessings. Stay connected with us as we continue to explore the wisdom of the Psalms. Until next time, May you find peace and joy in your prayers and daily life.